Virgo, it's L here to do your reading for this week. This will go from September 22nd through the 28th. Thank you for being here. Thank you to those who like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. All right, so let's get into it. All right, so the situation for this week, Virgo, is self-employment. Nice. Some of you are self-employed. Some of you are thinking about how to cultivate some or develop some idea, hobby, talent of yours into a full-on, full-time self-employment. Okay, so that's the situation here. Some of you already are self-employed. It says it's highlighted in regards to uh, maybe your efforts, the efforts of those around you, um, utilizing people, asking for help, in the need in the time of help in the time of needing help hmm. the advice here is relationship dynamics okay um so like you may be self-employed in regards to you may do something alone you may need to bring in a, a, a different dynamic of of your business structure maybe another person a partner um in some sense uh for some of you your relationship dynamic is really taking a toll on self-employment maybe you have a business with a partner maybe the relationship is not going so well and now the um the business is being uh magnified or, or the lack of effort or the discord in the relationship is spilling over into the business. Maybe there's not a lot of focus here. We're going to pull some cards here to kind of open up the reading and see what that's about. Someone feels differently in regards to this relationship uh, with the re relationship dynamics. The advice here is to really sit with yourself and understand your feelings, understand um where you stand with another person in regards to the romantic relationship and if it's business um in regards to the business and seeing where there can be open dialogue to try to come to some resolution um because there is something someone's entered exited the relationship someone feels differently someone's grown someone hasn't grown there's something here in regards to the dynamic of the relationship being uh, ch changed or transformed or it's morphed into. Uh, there could be distance here. So I'm hearing someone is trying to, um, they don't know if, if they embark on self-employment with their partner be as um, supportive in regards to maybe taking on a little bit more of the financial burden of you know household expenses will they be able to carry them until you know maybe the self-employment takes off or there is a profit made that's what i'm hearing somebody doesn't know of their support the outcome is take the next step now uh, baby steps break down your goals into baby steps this is what so I have um side note a course that um not even a course but um a very detailed financial um and business plan that helps people try to to do this the first the leg work in regards to starting business um really developing a concept really developing their business themselves their brand in regards to what it is they're doing and what it is they want to present to the world what they want to present to people so and a part of that business plan is breaking down things that you need to do into baby steps so you don't get everything done in one day or even one week maybe not even in one month um so it's about taking the next step, whatever that is. Um, in regards to self-employment or in regards to relation. Okay, two cards just flew out. 
Uh, some of you are restless now in your current position because you have a business idea. Take the next step. Some of you are hesitating before making decisions. Maybe in regards to a marriage, some long-standing union, contract, uh, organization, um, traditional values coming up here. Uh, let's see. Yeah, and it may be a Virgo woman. Lots of times for me, the Virgo woman comes up as the queen of swords. So this is about getting very truthful, clear with yourself in regards to um, maybe making a necessary decision, a change. The fives talk about change. You're hesitating before doing so, but there's something you need to embark on. Yeah, you need to have a change of journey or home. Some of you may be moving or you may be asking someone else to move. Um, this is wish fulfillment for you. Some of you want to be independent of you fill in the blank. A person, place, or thing. Yeah, unexpected money may come in for you. Good luck. Good fortune is here for you. If you lay down the burden that is um, maybe not making a decision in regards to some relationship. What's the, the best advice here for the Virgo as we close out the reading for this week? And this is oh, Ace of Hearts. A new friendship. A uh, new relationship can bring you a lot of happiness and contentment. This also talks about grounding yourself and um, being filled with spirit so that you make better decisions, spiritual growth. This also talks about, uh, I don't know, new home for some of you. This also is could be how people are seeing you. Reinventing, redeveloping, or something about development of self or business something you do fulfill it, it, it it's a uh, could be spiritually connected or, or some creative endeavor here king of swords wow um some skilled work the best course of advice is for you to be 10 steps ahead of whom or whomever or whatever also, maybe there might be Gemini, Libra, Aquarius involved here. This friendship, this love, this new love comes with opposition. Some of you have buried your head in the sand. Could be a Libra here. Or, or they're burying their head in the sand, not making a decision. Listening to friends or still being immature about this new love this new marriage either that's what you want from a particular person yeah you want a, a status change you want a leveling up you want a foundation um this could be um wish fulfillment yeah 11 11 guys um This could be a really dynamic relationship. The advice is to know that something is coming to fruition. I think this person will level up. Things don't happen always on your time. Just uh, remain focused and, uh, on you and what it is you can do to strengthen the relationship or the bond or to bring it back together. Um, you feel like someone's hesitating in regards to making a big decision. All right, I was only going to pull one card. Three popped out. It's up to you. Romance and opportunity. You may have the opportunity to start your own business. Uh, it's all up to you. Romance is here for you. Uh, once again, let go. Let go of trying to be in control of how this plays out. But just be... Be a cast member in this in this play because I think you get what you want in the end. Okay, if you find this reading resonated with you, for you go over to the website, book your own reading. You can get the situation advice and outcome reading. It comes to you via email, just like this, where I'll explain what the situation is for you. Okay, um, that's nine ninety nine. That link is below, or you can get a more in depth reading. Okay.
Thank you. Take care, guys. Remember to stay in prayer. I am praying for you. Pray for me as well. Bye.